because you find the derivative of y is equal to c, where c is a constant from first principle. So if y is equal to c from first principle, and we are to take the derivative of this, and they say c is a constant, derivative is the rate of change of one thing with respect to another thing. But if c is a constant, it means it's not changing. Therefore, if y is equal to c, y plus delta y is still equal to c. Why? Because c is not changing. They say c is a constant. Now, making delta y the subject, delta y should be equal to c minus y, but y is equal to c, therefore, that will be c minus c, which is zero. The c minus c is zero. And delta y over delta x is equal to zero over delta x. Zero divided by anything is zero. The delta y over delta x is equal to zero. The limit of delta y over delta x, derivative of a constant is zero. Okay, that is an important thing you need to take into the derivative of a constant is zero.